So let's do my nails. This is my inspiration that I got from Pinterest. So what I'm doing is I'm just removing all of my old Gel X polish with these clips, which are amazing. You can get them off of Amazon. I put acetone on them and then I let them soak on my nails. After that, I'm buffing my nail and making sure that all the excess glue is taken off and my nails are smooth and shape them how I would like. These are the products that I like to use. It seems like a lot, but if you want really good application for your Gel-X extensions, then I would highly recommend using these products. So I'm pushing back my cuticles here, making sure that I don't have any excess skin, and then I am going to clip those off. I really like this brand Apress for nails. They are very long lasting. They have a really good apex and they just fit so nicely from sidewall to sidewall. And honestly, I could go four weeks with my nails on without having to fix them. Then I use the Mondelez nail dehydrator just to take off any excess oils that I might have on my nails. Make sure that you are wearing protective gloves to help from the UV rays. This is a protein bond that I put after the dehydrator and I swear this actually works with making the nails adhere to your natural nails. Then I use the Apres Extend Gel. I'll put a little bit on my natural nail and then I'll put a dollop of it on the actual Gel X extension and I will put this under the UV light just so that it is adhering to my nail itself. And these are the nails on and then you just sit it in there for another 60 seconds to make sure that it cures all the way then i am cutting them to the length that i want and i am going to be shaping them i typically will go for an almond shape but that's just my personal preference um, i just like the way the almond shape looks on my hands in particular but you can shape them however you like then I like to buff the nail surface just so that my polish can adhere to the nail itself. So that's what I'm doing here. I'm just taking off any shine that I might have. Then I will use my nail drill just to merge the actual Gel X extension to my natural nail and get rid of any excess glue that might have been left over. And you want to make sure you're sealing your cuticles with acetone. Honestly, this is literally what makes your nails last a very long time. And now I'm just applying the nail polish and you're gonna obviously let that set. These nail polishes from this brand Gayoi, I got these from Amazon. I love these nail polishes. They're so sheer and pretty, but they work wonderfully as bases. You can't go wrong with Beatles nail polishes. I love the richness in these colors and literally i only have to do two coats of this nail polish because it's very pigmented i also like to do designs so i'm trying to recreate the design that i had in the picture that i put in the beginning and honestly this is what takes the longest it's very tedious but i feel so accomplished afterwards i've been doing my nails since the pandemic and i honestly love doing my nails these are the final nails and don't forget to like comment follow for more thank you guys